morning, Air Show fans. My name is John Clatt, proud owner of John Clatt Air Shows, and we're really delighted to bring to you in 2014 a one of a kind Air Show act, the biggest, baddest on the industry, the Screaming Sasquatch, brought to you by Jack Link's Beef Jerky. We partner with Jack Link's Beef Jerky to produce this one of a kind, unique Air Show airplane that would embody the spirit of Jack Link's Beef Jerky. And what we developed, I think, is the most unique air show act in the industry today. And what it is, it's a 1929 taper wing replica with a 985, 450 horsepower, nine cylinder piston engine in conjunction with a CJ610 J85 jet engine strapped to the bottom, producing more than 4,500 pounds of thrust on an airplane that weighs less than 4,000 pounds, which means a thrust to weight ratio of greater than one to one. So this airplane is able to accelerate going straight up. Let me take you on a little tour of the Screaming Sasquatch and hopefully you come out at one of the 2014 air shows, you may get a chance to see the Screaming Sasquatch in person. Let's take a look. The Screaming Sasquatch has a three-bladed Hartzell and we're very happy and special thanks to Joe Brown and his team at Hartzell to help us with this product. And the Hartzell is really where the rubber meets the highway with thrust of the 985. You can see it's a beautiful airplane, greatly finished. It has a speed ring that was uh, generated by the Yonkin family. If you look down here towards the bottom, you can see the jet engine portion. The jet has a uh, Learjet cowling that's been specifically modified for the Screaming Sasquatch. And as you can see, we have a tailpipe that vectors the thrust. Now, you may think that this is vectored in a haphazard way, but the design of the pipe is such that the thrust vector will go directly through the center of gravity, producing the exact line of flight that we're looking for to fly this airplane. If you walk around to the sides here, Airshow fans, you can see we have a stock taper wings that have been beefed up to withhold the additional weight of the CJ610. We have a larger eye struts, enhanced flying wires. The tubular structure of the airplane is actually a modernized carbon fiber top. This top piece is all carbon fiber. It's a one piece carbon fiber mold and it allows easy access for mechanical repairs and me mechanical inspection. The airplane, we actually moved it back, the cockpit back one bay. From a, if you get a chance to look at what a 1929 taper wing looked like, this airplane has a little bit more of a, a, a racing look to it. We did that to improve the center of gravity and give it the, the pilot enhanced visibility. Take a look at the cockpit. It has a modern, brand new MGL EFA system that is designed to monitor both engines in one display. It also has the ability to have a hairs, GPS, and all-in-one instrumentation. The tail is a very unique tail. As you can see, Sasquatch is, is a huge part of this airplane and he, he rests proudly and watches over his airplane on every flight. The tail is increased rudder and increased elevator and dimensions to improve three-dimensional flying. With the, with the improved thrust vector, we anticipate this airplane to grow into some very unique maneuvers and you're going to actually see today that the Screaming Sasquatch is the only airplane on the air show industry today that can come to a hover, stop, and accelerate. So today you're going to see this airplane fly up to 1500 feet, reduce thrust on the 985 and the CJ610, bring it to a stop, park it in the sky, hover, and accelerate up to 80 knots and top out. The airplane will achieve altitudes of 8,000 feet. We'll perform a maneuver that we call the Screaming Sasquatch, where we draw two S's in the sky, and virtually, this is four Immelmans back to back. I don't know another airplane today outside of a, a modern fighter jet that, that has millions of dollars invested that will do four back-to-back -back Immelmans and end up at 8,000 feet. From there, you're gonna see the pilot maneuver the airplane into an inverted flat spin from 8,000 feet and bring it right back down to show center. 
So you're going to see this airplane do some very unique things today, and it's a one-of-a-kind experience. We're excited that you're here. My name is John Clatt, owner of the Screamin' Sasquatch. We're proud to bring this to Thunder Over Michigan, and we're going to see you with the Jack Link's Beef Jerky Screamin' Sasquatch. I can't wait for you to see it.